one gig, sorry, two gigs of the Mushkin RAM. Which I have another, another one over there. And I'll be, I was going to be installing um, the operating system with a USB stick just because um, that will save on uh, the power output, you know, just so I don't have to waste a lot of power that way. But, um, in, but where I live at, it's an apartment building, so I don't have to pay for hydro. But, um, you know, so that's a good thing. But um, I, eventually, you know, they will find out, you know, that I'm running a lot of, a lot of power here. But um, as you can see here, there's my HP media server, my Linksys router, but um, yeah, eventually, you know, this whole place is going to be a, a lot more organized. I'm just, you know, everything's a little bit rough on the edges here, but uh, we'll get um, everything running smoothly. And there again is the six, seven video cards there. Another one over there. Three over there. There's three over there, two 6970s in the yellow case, and a 5830 in uh, the LAN box case in the bottom there. And all I do is just remote in on uh, the desktop here, but uh, it's not it's not set up right now. But uh, it's actually in here. So what over here I have is my playbook, and from here I'm able to see you know the current hash rate that each system is running at. So I'll let that focus in. Hopefully it focuses in. It looks like it doesn't want to focus in, but um. I only have seven cards running right now, but I will have the other seven running in about an hour. Actually, by tomorrow I should have it all running because I got to install the operating system on each uh, system there. But uh, over here, I have to cut the bottom off as you can see. It looks, a little, it looks, a, it looks pretty ghetto right now. And the reason is because I have to cut the bottom off because the way the case is and the way the motherboard is that um, the bottom card would not fit on the bottom because the bottom the bottom of the case was was actually preventing for me to install that uh, last video card there but I'm gonna be installing another video card in that slot and I'm gonna be taking up the, the Xeno Pro PCI, PCI Express uh, gaming network card. I'm going to take that out and put another video card in there. So I'm going to have five cards in here in, in this system. But um, yeah, if you have any questions in regards to how everything is set up and everything, you know, just uh, just give me a holler on my uh, on my YouTube page there and uh, and I'll see if I get you back. If I get back to you as quick as I can. Okay, thanks. Bye for now. Well, as you can see now, I do have the systems all set up, well, partially set up on the top one here. This one here has four cards. I am waiting to get the PCI 1, PCI Express 1 time to 16 times, so I can have these cards out of the slot and uh, have six cards per board. As you can see here, I'm only running one, two gigs of uh, DDR3 RAM. That is a 900 watt power supply, powering all these four cards. As you can see on this one here, I only have a 500 watt power supply running this one here. I'm only running these two cards because um, running more than two cards, like for example, running three cards, the the system shuts off and the reason is because uh, the, this power supply does not have an 8 pin connector as you can see from right here it only has a 4 pin you need the 8 pin to power the entire board otherwise it will shut off when you run when I'm running um, a Diablo Miner um, so as you can see here I have a couple more cards in the box there um, I still have to put them in this one here. I had two more identical boards like this coming in with uh, six more cards. Um, 
but I'm going to be running those six cars on just one system alone. But, uh, so yeah, that is the setup here, along with the other setup that I was that I did show previous. Um, so right now, just with this setup here, minus the two curves here, I am only running a 2.8-2.9 giga hash. So, so yeah, if you have any questions, feel free and uh, drop me a line here. I'll do my best to answer all those all your all your questions here. But um, yeah, that is the current uh, setup here. This one here, I finally took it down. As you see here that grid. I took the card out of that one. And now that that one just isn't running at all anymore. So, so yeah, that's it. Thanks.